At Stability AI, we're committed to releasing high quality generative AI models and sharing them generously with our community of innovators and media creators. Okay. They keep on saying, we acknowledge that our latest release, Stable Fusion 3 Medium, didn't meet our community's high expectations. Well, you all probably remember the Stable Diffusion 3 release. You might have seen the secret footage from the internal Stable Diffusion 3 meeting at Stability AI. Uh, check out my last video for that. And well, you know that the release didn't go really as planned, right? And they also say and recognize that the commercial license originally associated with SD3 caused some confusion and concern, right? So the model had issues. It wasn't only bad. Let's get to that later. It wasn't only bad. It was, it couldn't do human anatomy and it had a huge problem with the licensing being confusing and all over the place. So they say we made some improvements to address these concerns. Now they have a full update on their page, but they have a little summary here on um, Twitter. So I'm just going to dive through that. Uh, Non-commercial use remains free and there's uh, free commercial use for individuals and small businesses as long as your revenue is under one million dollars and that's yearly. And I asked them, okay, so what is if it's above a million dollars? Well, then you gotta apply for the enterprise license. But for everything else, all use cases, whatever you do, if your revenue is less than one million dollars annually, it's all free. And I asked, can you um, can you make derivative works? Can you create your own molds? Can you do like whatever you want? They basically say yes. Uh, so it opens up everything again. You can start using it. You can fine tune it and create more models. They will be releasing a new model. And it said somewhere here that it would be a few weeks. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let's get to that in a bit. Uh, I'm getting ahead of myself here. So here, people and organizations that install and run stability AI models on their own devices for non-commercial use can continue doing so for free. This applies to uh, most of our community, including researchers that usually publish the research for free, free open source developers, full-time students, teachers, hobbyists, fine tuners, whatever, whatever, yada, yada, that improve our models and distribute them. Uh, etc. Uh, fewer limits, there will be no restrictions on the number of media files that can be created with the Stability AI Community License Agreement. So that is the new name, the Stability AI Community License Agreement. Uh, there were some weird limits on SD3 previously that wasn't there for uh, 1.5, SDXL, 2.0, 2.1, etc. Uh, so that's all scrapped uh, and only commercial users need to self-report. So if you're making more than a uh, million dollars annually, go get the enterprise license. So does that mean uh, we're going to get a new pony model for SD3? Well, maybe, I guess. Do you know why the pony asked for a glass of water? Because it was a little horse. Then the next part here, improving model quality. So before we released SD3 Medium, our initial testing indicated that it was, in most cases, a much better base model compared to SDX, SDX in terms of prompt adherence, diversity, detail, and overall quality. And while I can agree on some parts there, I did some, some testing with SD3. Uh, I did a comparison for um, upscaling, which SD3 t totally beat 1.5 in SDXL. Uh, I didn't release that on YouTube. That's only uh, uh, like an hour long video on my Patreon, uh, if, you, if you're more interested in that. But uh, SD3 really shine when it comes uh, to upscaling. So whenever they are releasing this new improved model, I think it's gonna be Better, right and also like the base infrastructure the 16 channel VE the increased detail that you get from that VE is mm, you want that you want that so we gotta fight for uh, these new better models uh, but in regard to the previous release and the, this year however the community quickly identified some critical quality issues mainly related to body poses everyone remembers a woman lying on grass and words that were too rarely seen in the training sets and yes i had lots of problems getting proper anatomy i mean you could you saw glimpses of hope there right you could get some really great images but it's, it's like needle in a haystack for uh, particular types of styles subjects continuous improvement sd3 medium is still a work in progress we aim to release a much improved version in the coming weeks okay let's stop here I would love to see an improved version in the coming weeks. I wouldn't, I, I would probably, I would be wary with, with expecting too much here, right? So you want the new model, yes. 
but you want the model to be good, right? I spoke to some of the Stability AI employees. They say that their internal testing models are better, uh, but they also say that they need more time, right? So they, I hope they're not gonna push it quickly at this time. And I was told they are not. Be patient, wait for the models. I don't expect it in a couple of weeks, but who knows? We'll see, right? I'm gonna wait, sit here and wait patiently until we get a good model at least, or better. Because what we had was goodish, like, 70 80 percent of it kind of worked and then you had you know these other parts that were just super broken but uh, again it's a base model now we can at least fine tune it but uh i'm sure the fine tuners are gonna wait until we get the newly improved model and they keep on saying we are all researching how to best use this new architecture and model as we learn more about the best ways to use the model and to fine tune it we will share our finding as well as those of others in the community that's really cool i think and on the blog on their page they're basically saying the same thing we are recommitting to our customers and our core open source principles artist friendly pro creator freedom research align transparent and clear license terms so they're clearly taking the listening to the community i mean i i, I from personal experience i need, even know that some of them saw the secret footage from inside of uh, stability and i get it we were making fun of them the main part here is i think when Ever you are making a, a mistake, or I'm not saying who made a mistake or what, what and whatever, but you know, someone makes a mistake and you actually, instead of canceling and removing and replacing, you're actually learning from that mistake, improving, evolving and moving forward. I think that's the main part here, right? Community focused and values driven open source philosophy, committed to regular communication and engagement with our users. And I think that this part here is where I want to see some improvements, right? Um, because the communication has been totally lacking. It's been dead silent and that's, you know, kind of need to step up there. And they kind of keep saying the same thing that they did on Twitter. Behavior said they fixed the license, same topics, non-commercial, free commercial up to a million, fewer limits. Same thing about the improved quality. If you want to dig more deep into this, just go check the blog, right? Uh, and they said next steps, we're updating our FAQ with additional details as we finish updating our licenses. And uh, I think that the old license was like 20-ish pages and the new one is, I think it's like two, three. Uh, you might, yeah, look, looking at that, it can't, I mean, yeah, there's some scrolling to the right. Okay, so it could be two, three pages. Um, but you can find it on Hugging Face, on Stability AI. You have the Stable uh, Diffusion 3 Medium, and you have the license, and it's been updated two hours ago. And it's something now called Stability AI Community License Agreement. I'm not going to bore you with the details, and also I'm not a lawyer, so whatever I say about this is just an interpretation of a dummy on YouTube. So I'm going to spare you that. All you need to know is they want to be better, so. Let's give them the opportunity to be better. Can we make fun of someone when they're making an, uh, an error? Sure. Why not? Just be a little nice too, right? Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. See ya.